Hey, what's going on, man? This is Dr. Rod D. Ferguson. I'm kind of inspired to do this video right now because of my man, Mike Dolce. Mike uh, provides some excellent advice, uh, some of the secrets that we use in the combat sports and combat preparation space. Um, a lot of individuals want to know what is the, what's the most important thing from a strength and conditioning perspective when it comes to MMA athletes or judo athletes, etc. I can tell you this. The most important thing is not what you do to prepare for the tournament or prepare for the fight. It's what you do before your fight camp starts. On the diet side, it is the maintaining a good, healthy diet and not necessarily eating pizza and chips and going off the rails. Um, you can eat more, but you eat more, but keep it clean. Uh, on the strength and conditioning side, one of the best activities that I can give you is when you don't have a fight coming up, you do the following. You take a, you go one day on, one day off, and you do this. You use a, what we have, we call a, a Aerodyne bike. Aerodyne bike or a, I like to use a Rogue Echo bike. We use the Rogue Echo. You do the Rogue Echo bike, one minute on, one minute off until you hit 450 calories on the Rogue Echo bike. If you don't have a Rogue Echo bike and you're using a Polar monitor or a Garmin watch, it's 680 calories. One minute on, one minute off. The minute on, you're sprinting. The minute off, you're still riding. Keep your arms on the bike. Keep your feet on the bike. The discipline of continue to pedal, continue to pedal when you're tired is what you're going to need. This is one of the major things that we did in the preparation for um, Sadiq Youssef's UFC fight. Before his camp even started, we went through a pre-camp phase of about four and a half to five weeks so that when camp started, we did not have to worry about conditioning. When camp started, we were worrying about power and power conversion. Those are some of the tricks. Those are some of the tips. And a lot of people don't want to take the time to do the arduous, draining and boring work in between fights. That's where you, that is where you really, really, really build your skill. I tell fighters all the time, when you don't have a fight coming up, man, you need to go to jujitsu practice and you need to go to boxing practice. Go to the regular classes. You'll have time to work with your pad guy. You have time to go to the regular classes at your gym and stay sharp. It's called active rest. You're resting, but you're active. Take care. Have a super fantastic day. Remember, this is Dr. Roddy Ferguson. I love you, but God loves you best. And uh, one more thing. If you are interested in getting in some great shape, you want to go to www.circuittrainingmadeeasy.com. Um, enjoy yourself and enjoy your life. I'm enjoying mine. Thank you.